Welcome back. We're joined now by Glenn Barnhart. He is the managing director of the Memorial City Hall Performance Center. Thank you so much for swinging by here today. Well, thank you for allowing me to be here. Hey, it's our pleasure. So tell me a little bit about this performing arts hall. Memorial City Hall is a brand new 550 seat performing arts center in downtown Marshall. It's on the historic town square. It was their original city hall built in 1920. And uh, it was the city. It was the center of city government for 67 years. And then when they moved into a new building, we decided to save it and turn it into a performing arts center. That's pretty cool. It's got some history there. Yes, some and, character. And we're very excited. We just opened two weekends ago with our first concert, and we have a wonderful lineup of uh, country western stars, rock and roll, theater, comedy, drama, everything. Hey, East Texas has it all, right? That's true. <laughs> so, what kind of programs will y'all be offering there? What do you have planned? This Saturday night, Texas country legend Gary P. Nunn will be performing at 7:30 p.m., and then all the way from Dublin, Ireland, our Christmas show is Celtic Angels Christmas and that is the Irish, uh, traditional Irish Christmas songs and uh, our Christmas songs with the full band, the Irish dancers, and then these beautiful ladies singing all the harmonies. So we're very excited to be able to bring international artists to East Texas. Yeah, so um, it sounds like these are definitely family friendly events. That oh you know. yes, of course, everything is family friendly. And then in January, we have Farewell Angelina, which is up and coming country western stars. And then One Night in Memphis, which is a tribute to Elvis Presley, Johnny Cash, Carl Perkins, and Jerry Lee Lewis, will be here in February. Uh, in March, we have Aguilla Theater, all the way from London, England, performing uh, George Orwell's 1984. And then in April, we have the Wonder Bread Years, which is a hilarious look at growing up in America in the 50s, 60s, and 70s. How cool, already all booked up. For our first season, yes, and now we're looking at next year. Yeah, if people are interested in uh, maybe reaching out to perform there, is there a good email or something for them? Uh, yes, my email is barnhart.glenn at marshalltexas.net or just go to our website, memorialcityhall.com. Cool, so it sounds like this might be a new tourist attraction from downtown Marshall area. It is. We are poised to be another asset in uh, Harrison County. We're downtown on the square next to the historic courthouse. And so now with a beautiful 1920s era Art Deco building that's renovated, we, we have that as our performing arts center. And then in the basement is a museum dedicated to the veterans of Harrison County. It, it was Memorial City Hall was named Memorial to dedicated to World War I veterans. And so in the basement area, we have the exhibit Service and Sacrifice Harrison County at War. And so we have beautiful uh, artifacts and exhibits all the way from World War I through the Gulf Wars. How cool. So if people are interested in attending the um, performance this weekend, where can they get tickets? Tickets are available on the website memorialcityhall.com or call us at 903-934-7992. All right, Glenn, thank you so much for stopping by here today. Wonderful to be here. Thank you. Absolutely.